Um, actually, malaki yung pasasalamat ko sa show na to because this is my very first time in my whole life, I'm 27 years old, to finally have abs. Okay, ngayon lang ako na-inspire at natakot na marami palang makakakita ng katawan ko. So, I finally hit the gym <laughs> for like four months straight and my dreams have come true. I finally have abs and I'm gonna put them out in 2018. <laughs> Hmm? January. Yeah. Well, this is your first time to work with Jason Avalos, Ivan, and Migo Adesar. How was working with them? Um, Migo plays my brother, and we've shot scenes together na, uh, and it felt shockingly natural, as in, uh, it's almost creepy how natural it became. Um, with Jason Abolos, I'm really enjoying uh, doing scenes with him. I'm very excited that this is his first show as a kapuso. Um, I'm making binyag Jason Abolos. Um, uh, yeah, he's a great scene partner, and parang I can tell na once na inspire siya sa character niya, dami niyang magdadagdag na wala, sa, wala naman sa script. Um, Ivan, wala pa kaming scenes together, but uh, I I have conversations with him behind the scenes. Thank you. John. Hi. Hi. Uh, okay, <laughs> the traffic sucks, no? <laughs> yeah, a little, and it's also free. Uh, first off, um, I, I'm sure you want to spend Christmas in your own home or anywhere else with your family. What, what are your plans? Really? Um, are you going to be working because of this show? No, they are kind enough to uh, give us Christmas off. Oh, hindi naman sila mga monster. But what are your plans? Uh, at home. At home, the whole family is coming over. Everyone's going to cook different things. Uh, I'm absolutely sure that there's going to be baked prawns and like Putanesca because it happens every single year. Um, but the other things, I don't know what we're going to eat. It's really all about food in my family. And uh, then at, uh, after dinner, we open the You cook? I, I only usually cook diet food, so I don't cook on Christmas. Mm. That's the only time I don't cook. How do you relate to your character? Ano yung, so, sorry, yeah. sorry. Um, How do you relate to your character? Man? How close is your character in real life? Nahirapan akong hanapin yung, yung relationship ko kay Zoe. Kasi parang when I, was, when I was reading the character description, I felt like she's everything I hate in a girl. <laughs> okay. Um, but as I was going through the script and I was trying to find my own version of Zoe, I realized that she's actually the guilty pleasure Rian in the back of my head. Na hindi siya hindi siya na iya at all to speak her mind. Hindi siya nag filter at all. Pag may na isip siya sa sabi niya right away. Um, ayon. So parang natuwa ako na because I'm an overthinker naman. Um, so, but in some ways, while I'm playing Zoe, she's setting me free, you know? And na feel ko na unti unti na din akong umaarte. <laughs> I'm starting to take really long when I'm like, I think before the, I leave the house, I curl my hair now. It's happening to me. Um, yeah, but I have a tendency talaga to bring my characters a little bit into real life, which is why I'm extra annoying today. <laughs> if you've noticed. Thank you. Thank you.